Hey guys, it's your Friday doll on the Beauty Dolls, and today's DIY is going to be how to make your own eyelid primer. What you're going to need is a body butter. I'm using the Azure body butter. Um, you want something that's going to be safe for your eyes, but you want a body butter because they are thicker than normal lotions. Just a thick cream. And then after that, the next thing we're going to need is a loose powder. I'm just using the Spare Minerals Foundation and if it's in your skin tone that's better because this will act as a concealer, moisturizer, and eyelid primer at the same time. And so the next ingredient is a concealer. I'm using MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. You want to use a concealer that has a drier formula like this does because um, it will help the shadows not to crease. Some toothpicks and you're also going to need a container to put it in. Um, I recommend keeping it in like a small sample container similar to this. I'm just using it in this so you could see like what I'm doing. Okay, so first I'm just going to open this up and I'm going to take a toothpick and I'm just going to scoop some out. You can use however much you need. Um, you don't need too much because remember it's just primer and you don't need to use that much primer. There's about that much in there. And then you want to use the same amount of concealer as you do um, moisturizer. So I'm just going to put a pump of this here. And then that's not enough. So I'm going to put two, three pumps of concealer. And there's that much in there so far. I'm just going to take the toothpick and mix those together. Then to give it a little bit more of a drier formula, I'm going to take this loose powder and I'm just going to scoop some of that into there. You don't need too much of this, just enough to thin or thicken up the formula, not thin it out. <laughs> and that'll make it so it won't crease. And then I'm just going to mix that up into there. Just make sure it all gets mixed in and it's all even. And as you can see, since this is skin tone, it will conceal any discoloration on your eyes and any veins that you might have showing. And once you've mixed that all together, you're basically done. I'm just going to show you what this looks like. Um, you're just going to take it. You only need a little bit. Just stab it onto your eye and blend it in like that. And just to give you a little comparison, I'm going to take an eyeshadow from my um, Natural Eye Palette by Too Faced. This palette right here, I'm going to open this up. I'm just going to take this color because that's the first one that I came to. And I'm just going to show you it without anything underneath it. That's what it looks like with no primer over here. And as you can see, it is so much more pigmented and so much darker. And this formula of primer lasts a long time for me. It also works when you're working with light colors too. It is that pigmented so as you can see it just makes them much much more pigmented and you can just see that it has much better pigmentation with the primer and it's a concealer so that's great so that's it on how to make your own primer make sure you keep it in a container like this so that it doesn't dry out and this is a lot cheaper than buying a primer and it works just as well so i hope you enjoy this video and i will see you next friday bye guys